what's up everybody and welcome back to life is strange before the storm now chloe just got expelled and uh that was a whole mess and um now now she's gonna get real you know i i, I feel for chloe i really do and david doesn't make things any easier but um yeah <laughs> It's only going to get worse before it gets better, but let's get on into it. Chloe, your mother and I have been talking. Mm-hmm. Can we do this later? I don't think I can handle another fight right now. And who do you expect to handle things for you? Your mother? I don't need a conversation. Not with Sergeant Asshat here. I just need some space. Do not use that language with your mother. That's it's so sad. Like, she doesn't even know what to say to her kid anymore. Like, I, I just... Uh, hmm. If my mother has something to say, she will say it to me. She has. The problem is... You don't listen. Maybe if you try listening to me, instead of fighting me about everything, you might actually learn a thing or two. What? Like how to have no job? Or how to be a soldier? Soldiers put family and future above self and now. Getting kicked out of school? That's what losers do. You had a scholarship, Chloe. Do you know what that means? What kind of opportunity you gave up? Do you want to work at the diner? <laughs> There's nothing wrong with waiting tables, Mom. Chloe, I'm proud to wait tables because it means you can be whatever you want to be. But what is that, Chloe? What do you want? Maybe... I don't know yet. Maybe? You've had long enough to figure it out. What? Right now, what I need most of all is for the two of you to start getting along. Chloe, I care about Joyce very much. I'm willing to forgive you for the incident yesterday. If you improve your attitude going forward. Incident? What incident? I'll just say, we had a rather frank discussion. But, with an apology, I'm willing to start over. It's so sad, like, you had long enough to figure it out. She's not even 18 yet. He's what, probably 15, 16, something like that. Like, she doesn't know what the heck she wants out of her life yet. Come on. Sure. Reset button pressed. I am glad to hear it. From now on, I will be assisting your mother in a few areas. Like making sure that you are no longer abusing drugs or alcohol. Mom. Chloe, I'd like you to empty your pockets and place all your belongings on the trunk of the car. What the Jeez. Fuck? If we are going to start over, we have to know that you are not abusing drugs. If you're not, you should be eager for the chance to prove it. Mom. I don't need more discipline from you. I need my mom. I know, Chloe. And I'm sorry. But David feels... Joyce. We feel this is the best way to start fresh. Let's go, Chloe. Quit stalling. Oh, God. All right. Hi. You want to see my shit so badly?
That's not that bad. I mean, it's bad, but it's not that bad. Ooh, weed! Oh no, the horror. Happy? It's marijuana, all right. <laughs> no, marijuana. I am not happy, but I am relieved that you came clean. I hope this can be the beginning of a new chapter for us. A new chapter, one that will involve the three of us together. W what does that mean? We both agree that the best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to move in. Ugh. No fucking way! Chloe, after everything that's happened, uh, I'm at a loss. I need help. Exactly. We need a firmer hand steering this ship. Talk to me, Chloe. Tell me what you're feeling. That's a good question. Uh. You're trying. I, I get it. I, I swear, I do. And I've been making it harder for you. But this is not the answer. It's the only answer I have, Chloe. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. I'm sorry I took that for granted. I'm not choosing anyone over anyone else. It's about the three of us having a home together. It'll be better than you think, Chloe. Once everything's running smoothly, you'll see what a stable home can be like. David's not exactly stable. There is no home. Not if he's there. Chloe. Let her go. She'll come home as soon as her tantrum is over. Jeez. Poor Chloe. I get that they're trying to help her out, but she doesn't want help from David. How do you know which way is up when your whole life has been turned upside down? It sucks because she's just like, I mean, she misses her dad. Her dad was her whole world. And her mom doesn't apparently want to know well, what to do. With me. I can't go home anymore. Is this junkyard all I've got left? Too bad, because she's actually pretty smart when it comes to, like, cars and Ugh. stuff like that.
This thing is a mess. But maybe I can fix it. If this beast will ever run again, the first thing it needs is a new battery. Alright, so we gotta find some sort of battery. What? L2... Oh, uh... Get a battery to put in truck. Yeah, that's an understatement. Question is, where'd we find one? Uh, let's see... What about... What about this? What are you trying to hide under there, Hood? I don't know why she couldn't take this truck. I mean, the only thing this thing is missing is a door. But no. Let's go for the uh, beat up looking one. Here we go, the pick of the litter. All right. Let's see if this works. Jeez. Okay, let's not set some more things on fire. Using a screwdriver to start a car. Really? This thing needs more love than I can give right now. In the meantime, maybe I can spruce it up a bit. Yeah. Probably a good idea to cover over this with something. While an escape hatch could be nice, I should probably cover over this massive hole. <laughs> Maybe there's another light bulb I can put in here. Uh-huh. What's this? <laughs> what is that? Some sort of bobblehead thing? <laughs> you can hang here, but I get to pick the tunes. Okay? Good talk. <laughs> What's this? You're a long way from the beach. This could cover that torn seat and look awesome doing it. The moldy seat. Huh. Nice. Hope my passengers enjoy the smell of sea salt and junkyard. Here we go. Damn, you cigarettes.
Oh, here we go. Now let's climb it. What? What did you see? I don't get it. Climbing again? What are we climbing now? Oh, wow. I can't believe Rachel set that fire. I don't think she meant to, but I also don't think she didn't mean to. Yeah, I, I, I think she so did. Destructive can also be so beautiful. Or a fire that began in a trash can could grow to light up the entire sky. In conclusion, fire. Pretty sweet. <laughs> that fire's still burning? Did they not put that out yet? Like, uh, pretty sure the forest is on fire now. <laughs> like, it's probably gonna spread here next. Goodness. All right, let's get back to uh, putting our car together, I guess. Uh, oh, graffiti. What do I want to tell my fellow sailors of the seven trash heaps? <laughs> uh... Buried treasure. I, I don't know. <laughs> she made a treasure map? I don't know for a fact that there isn't buried treasure there. Today, you begin an exciting new life as a floor mat. I saw that, and I didn't think you could actually pick that up. Damn. I was wrong. All right, let's cover this hole. I don't remember her truck looking like this in the first game, but okay. Always nice to know you won't accidentally fall out into the road while driving. <laughs> What's that? You might not work. Then again, I hardly ever work. <laughs> there we go. Just shove that light bulb in your pocket. <laughs>
There we go. Okay, there we go. Fix. <laughs> this thing looks like a rusted out shopping cart. It probably drives like one too. <laughs> That's if it ever does drive, which seems questionable. Still, how sweet would that be? Who is this? Yeah? Right, it's Frank. Oh. Hey, Frank. What's up? Yeah, just checking in to see how you're doing. Really? No. Listen, we've got some business to discuss. Oh, no. What, what about... Oh, like... drugs? Right. I'm hanging out in the junkyard, north of town. The junkyard, that's great. Stay there, I'll see you soon. Okay. And, Frank? Um... What? Burner phone? Is everything cool? Uh... I'm not in trouble or anything, right? I don't know. Did you do anything you should be in trouble for? <laughs> like, in general? Or to you? We'll see you soon. Oh boy. I better know what that's about. Time for a hard earned smoke break. You only get one chance to make a first expression. Mystical or Frightening. Uh... The eye sees all. Shit. I slept all day. Well, what the hell? What the fuck? Dad? Oh god. That's weird. This is a nightmare.
What? What? Why is it just roasting marshmallows on the burning car? What? What? I miss him so much. What? Dad, what are we doing here? He's, oh my god, that's so weird! What? I wonder if it burned like this the day... The day it happened. What? What? I am so freaked out right now. I don't get Amazing, get what? isn't it? I can't look away. No! Sure. Don't pretend you're not mesmerized too. No, this is not okay. See? You're so drawn to it, you don't even realize the danger. Danger? Fire blinds us, just like darkness. But darkness blinds with absence, with loss. What does fire blind with? Beauty. Oh, and now it's dark. What? But sometimes, there's a greater beauty yet to come incredible fire is jealous Chloe it wants all the beauty for itself that's why you need to be careful uh mm -mm. what double voices mm -mm. oh don't look at me okay. oh 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 Oh!